So he's either thinking about getting some storm out or, wow, that's a lot of zealots. Um, Free already has a massive army. So <laughs> I think it's going to be very hard for Nada to defend this. You see Nada uh, sending out a scout finally. I think he's definitely got to bring his tanks forward. He is finally bringing them forward with some Goliaths. A very nice uh, military from him. You see his scanning there. He's going to know exactly what Free has. So we'll see if he's able to deal with it. I think he really needs to siege right now. Finally sieging. Uh, he's got to take care of those Zealots. Those Zealots are going in. Oh, man. This is going to be... <laughs> Major battle, all these tanks going down. You see, there's just nothing to deal with the zealots in the front. All these ta siege tanks just being mauled to death. Oh man, I think <laughs> uh, Nada should have brought his, ta his stuff up earlier than that. You see, he is fighting off now, but he lost so many tanks. And Free just lost Dragoons there, so... You see, Free is expanding again. <laughs> Getting a, another expansion with cannons there to fend off any kind of vulture harassment. This is not looking good for Nada right now. Um, Nada going out there with some vultures I think on the map. Free's not going to be able to do any kind of harassment. I think Free has pretty much blocked off all of his entrances to his expansions. You see there are some mines out so that huge tank loss is definitely going to hurt Nada here, but looks like Nada is going out anyway. He's going out with what he has right now, which is a lot of vultures, a lot of goliaths, and a few tanks. Let's see if he's able to set up any kind of defense here. He's kind of uh, going around the map here, probably checking for expansions. I'm not sure if he's seen those bottom two expansions from Free or not. It looks like he's setting up an expansion of his own here. Uh, it might be difficult for him to defend this with just uh, vultures. You see, he's pumping only vultures now. So he's definitely thinking about getting a lot of mines out. And looks like the Stargate is going up here. So I think we're going to see some Arbiter play from Free since he has that Templar Archives out already. And Nada's doing the best he can to hold this in the middle. He's, he's got to get a lot more tanks in here, though, if he wants to deal with this many Dragoons and <laughs> Templars out. So he's going to be stormed. So a lot of fans looking on, cringing. I'm not sure if he'll be able to defend this. You see, he is fending off that shuttle with Goliath. He's got to uh, turn Micro on here because he's going to need Micro to get through this. There are those vultures there in the middle, laying all kinds of mines. They might be out of mines by now, actually. And uh, Free moving in here, going to try to clear all those mines. You see Free, all he's got to do is focus on these tanks, and he's got this. Um, Nada is doing the best he can to defend against these tanks, but so many storms. Oh, Nada, just being uh, ripped apart here by what Free has. All those tanks going down. See vultures out. But the vultures can't do much against this, and now that expansion is going to go down. He's going to have to lift that and uh, take it somewhere else. Well, folks, I think we're going to see an all Protoss semifinals, because uh, there's, there's not much that Nada can do to get back in this game. He's going to be so far behind as far as economics go here. He's done a pretty good job of defending there against Freeze Army. But I think it's only a matter of time because he's not going to be able to get any kind of a, an expansion. See, Free already has four running bases. And now he's working towards Arbiters, so it's going to be Spell Doom for Nada coming up here in a second. I just don't think Nada brought his A game to this series for whatever reason. See, he does have a lot of factories out, a lot of... Um, factories without machine chop so we're going to see a lot of vultures from him it looks like Nada's I mean free is expanding again see Nada was able to spot that he's going to be able to work at that pylon with that single vulture <laughs> now uh, two star gates out so we might be seeing actually some carrier play from free or if he's just going to mass up some arbiters or not I'm not sure why he's building two stargates there. Oh, a lot of storm. Uh, <laughs> uh, it looks like that Nada is not going to be able to defend this command center at all. See, so he's working at these dragoons, the siege tanks, trying to protect the tanks. 
for the you can't really protect against Psy Storm. See uh, all those tanks going down, and now it's like only vultures for Nada right now. Not as laying some mines, going to be able to track some mines into those goons and fight off for the meantime. But I think he's only delaying the inevitable. See that command center is going down. That's going to put him really far behind. He's trying to go in here with mines, but there's an observer out, so those are going to be useless. Now Free is moving in a large army here. He might not even need to pump Arbiters at this point. He's moving in with a ton of Zealots. The Zealots are going in, clearing mines, bringing the mines straight to the tanks. Just great play from Free in this series so far. Uh, I think Free is very deserving of taking this series because he's just played great. Uh, was not afraid to cheese at all, <laughs> dragging mines everywhere. And now Nada is stuck in his own base. Not the position you want to be in as a Terran player. You see Nada is doing what he can to siege and uh, try to take out all of these Dragoons with so many Dragoons out. Man, see Nada is going out with some vultures and it's still sieging those those dragoons from free. I don't think Free's paying that much attention to everything. He doesn't really need to. He can just select all he has and do attack move right now and take out Nada's troops. Now he's pumping from two Stargates. So you might be seeing uh, two Arbiters out very soon. And you see he is very nicely blocked against Vulture Rasmus. I think that's one of the main reasons he was able to keep his expansions pretty much unharassed in this whole game. I don't think Nada was able to do any kind of harassment at all. So, uh, Free's just been unharassed and he's been able to build up completely here, doing some nice mind dragging there. And now he's completely pushing in here to the natural expansion. This is going to be over very soon. You see, there's going to be a storm here. Oh, it looks like the Templar was taken down by Nada. And Nada's actually able to hold that defense. But I think it is only temporary. Nada definitely needs a third base if he wants to think about getting back in this. Because look at all these bases from Free. Free has almost five bases now. And now he's just moving in his troops. Probably has them on attack move. And uh, see if he's able to break through all these tanks. See Free going in with the Zealots. This Arbiter's going to be out soon. And I think that's going to seal the deal for him. Nada is fighting the best he can, but all of these siege tanks are going to go down just by a simple zealot play here. And, um, yeah, Nada's just delaying the inevitable. The Arbiter, excuse me, is out. And looking pretty bad for Nada here. Nada is scanning, trying to do what he can to defend against this. But man, he just cannot keep those tanks defended. Those tanks are pretty much what cost him the game because he lost so many tanks there at the beginning not able to defend them properly against all those zealots great unit composition from free he knows just the right amount of units to get out there man all protoss semifinals why god why <laughs> um, I think actually free will have to face Bisu so um, kinda I don't think he's gonna make it past that little battle but we'll see. There's the GG from Nada. Nada not putting up uh, as great a fight as I thought he would. I thought Nada was going to actually show us some interesting strategies and great play, but his interesting strategy failed, and his great play is not as great as Freeze. See Nada looking very disappointed there. Um, I hope he's able to practice up and uh, come back in the next MSL or maybe the next OSL and show us something there. Oh, Free. You know, ever since Free took down Jadong, I have just not liked the guy. Whoever beats Jadong, I don't like usually. Except maybe Stork. <laughs> but, yeah. I hope he gets what's coming to him when B2 takes him on in the semifinal B. Well, this has been Nuke. I am probably going to cover the GOM Intel Classic tomorrow. And uh, we'll be covering the semifinals and the finals of the MSL. All Protoss. Can't even believe it. Okay, it says Manuk. Bye bye.